And here we're introduced to a new character. Help me! That character is pretty much like the Ashley of this game, if you're familiar with Resident Evil 4. Luckily, you don't have to guide her around quite as much, though. Now, I can go this way, but I'm not going to do that just yet. I have far too many things in my inventory, so I'm going to go ahead and empty some of it out first. So I went on and used the precinct key uh, on the on the door that leads into the into the offices with Marvin with Marvin's little space. I didn't enter the room yet though. I just did that so I could get it all out of the way. And we'll go ahead and head towards the lab. Come on, guys, get up. We'll go ahead and head towards the library now. And as you can see, this is a pretty good upgrade over the normal handgun. As I said, I'm not 100% sure if it actually does any more damage than the original handgun. But it's definitely a lot faster, and it seems to be taking them out pretty decently. Used up a little more handgun ammo than I would have liked, but that's alright. If I remember properly, there will be more right down here. Handgun ammo? Yeah, I guess not. Huh. Interesting. No, for a fact, there will be something over here, though. Open sesame. Ha! Here we go. Handgun ammo. Oh no. I made a mistake. Oh no, I did not. Good. Here we go. Oh, wait. What? Right, I forgot about that. <laughs> they open up anyhow in the uh, in scenario B, which is unfortunate, but I'll take it. Yes, they actually break down. Oh no! Look who got slow down. I don't remember slow down happening there with Leon. Wow, this is really heavy duty slow down. What's going on? Okay. Come on, Claire. You, you can do it. Step out of your animation so we can fix ourselves here. Wow, this is worse than I ever got with Leon. Go ahead, fix yourself, Claire. There we go. Whew, at least I was able to fix... Well, kind of fix it. Before, or without having to to exit out of the recording. Uh, yeah. That's the one thing that keeps preventing me from continuing this Let's Play. Those slowdowns are really getting annoying, but what can I do? So as you can see, there's actually a different item in here. Uh, this is another inconsistency. Is the fact that technically Leon should have already opened that since, he, since the door was clearly unlocked already. He should have already opened that, and there should have been a key inside. But there was not, or not a key. There should have been a, a rook plug, I think it was. Did just stop on them. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, that was weird. I don't understand what happened there. I've never had fraps stop on me mid-game before, but uh, we won't let it stop us. We'll just continue on. That was, wow, that was like a mind of its own or something. Better not happen again. I don't feel like dealing with that in editing. Alright, so we'll go ahead and we'll head around here first so we can finally get rid of these jewels because they're taking up a lot more space than I'd like them to. So we'll go ahead and we'll also stow away that little stone tablet we got, the uh, red one. That should be easy enough. Drop that right in here. Keep the diamond key, because I don't quite remember what door that goes to, to be honest. I did use it to get into the Mar into Marvin's office, but other than that, I don't remember where else it goes. So, 
plop these right into where they belong. And I believe the same... No, the same key does not come out of this guy. What comes out of him this time? I don't remember. Ah, right. We get the blue tablet, but I believe it's only half, yes. Half a blue tablet. So now that that now that, 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 now that that is out of the way, I believe we can head. Can we head? I believe the ladder might be down, or the stairs rather. I'm not 100% sure on that, but it doesn't hurt to go ahead and check. And just to be safe, I'll go ahead and save. So I believe Mr. X would like to have a word with me. So we'll go ahead and save. So I've only, how many times have I saved so far? Twice. So yeah. Doesn't hurt to save one other time. Alright. So that's out of the way. We'll go ahead and put all this junk back. Or put the ink ribbon back, rather. And I'll go ahead and head to the, uh, the clock area. The clock tower, the little gears room. I believe the, the ladder... I keep wanting to call it a ladder. Those are stairs. It's just the way they come down. It's so odd. But, um, I want to believe the stairs are still down. I can't remember, though. For the life of me, I can't remember. Let's go ahead and see what I get here. Alright, no, not yet. I believe he won't attack me at all. Okay, now that I think about it, it's probably still going to be up, which is another inconsistency, as you can see. But yeah, I do still need to find the crank, so <clears throat> we won't worry about that for now. So I do suppose that the only other place I can go right now is Marvin's office, where I believe I will get the heart key to go into the basement. Simple enough. Come on, Claire. There you go. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> the red herb right there to the right of the door, if you'd notice. I'm not going to be picking that up because I don't need it at, the, at this moment. But for anyone playing along... <laughs> for anyone playing along, I feel so bad for you. <laughs> because of the gaps in updates. But for anyone playing along, that red herb is there. <laughs> mm, I made a wrong turn, but it all leads to the same place eventually anyway, so I'll go ahead and handle this real fast. Now, have I opened this yet? No, I have not, surprisingly enough. First aid spray, always nice. <clears throat> huh. I thought this room would be filled with zombies again. Aha, the lockpick. Oh, so I did miss... Oh, no, no. She has to have this item, I forgot. All I need now to destroy the wall is the detonator. We have a quiver of arrows, which now means I have no room in my inventory, so I'm going to have to drop something. Can't pick that up, but we're not going to deal with that. Uh, once again, for anyone playing along, that uh, that's another photo. It can be added to your files. I, re I already realized uh, upon watching my playthrough of Leon that I already goofed up a few... Uh, few items that should have been found that I unfortunately did not by mistake a couple of photos mostly and a lot of files but you know I did my best fortunately my best just wasn't good enough as I eat a mint <laughs> I 
This is one of those after dinner mints. They're not quite as good. And I went the wrong way. Darn it. <clears throat> no, why the hell not? I have two spots now. Let's get the, uh... Let's get this. I should have put the plastic explosive away, though. Oh, well. Too late now. <clears throat> Thank you for letting me kill your friend, zombie. That was quite kind of you. I don't really need this. <clears throat> See. Kill you too. I do not believe Marvin is in here anymore. He does, however, have the detonator for the plastic explosives. Don't ask me why. He just does, and apparently Leon completely missed that in his uh in his little venture into this room. Actually I can combine these now to free up some space. And we have the letter to Leon, or memo to Leon, that we've already read, so I won't read it again. Unlock that. Actually, I'll head out through that way, too, since... It's towards the direction we have to go, after all. I thought we'd get the heart key out of there, but I was wrong. It happens sometimes, what can I say? <clears throat> Crap! <clears throat> I'll do that later. I meant to go back and, uh, that's what I forgot to do. I meant to go back and develop the footage, but, you know, or footage, not footage, the film. Either way, I meant to go and develop it, but I, I done goofed, I done goofed. It's alright, though. We'll worry about that later, it's just a picture to be added to the files. <clears throat> 